Hey everybody, this is The Last of In GameCube. Welcome back to more The Legend of Zelda Breath of the Wild. In the last episode, we arrived here into a Lurlin village, got three, got like four shrines done, and collected a whole bunch more Korok seeds. In this episode, we're going to be getting a lot more Korok seeds and hopefully getting a few other shrine quests and another piece of armor. Yes, you heard me right. Piece of armor. Now, the piece of armor is actually going to be located in one of the stables that we're going to find here. I think the stable is somewhere around there. Oh, oh well, the shrine, the shrine meter will tell me where it is. Anyways, regardless, I'm hoping I can make it over there. Uh, oh, it's for Rorsch, okay. Campfire there. I'm not gonna go there. Shrine nearby, of course. Oh, this seed. Okay, this seed is actually fun. Oh, crap. Not this one. You know what? You idiots can screw yourselves. Alright, now we're done with that. The Master Sword ran out of energy. Oh well. That's alright. And great. I gotta put all my metal... Keep that equipped. And I'll keep that equipped too. Actually... Uh, what weapon... Oh, I can equip this. Yay! Um... Oh, I know where I am. Okay. Got that up. And there's one more of these that we need to grab. Excellent! Okay. Now this next shri- Oh, is that a big hearty radish? Oh my god, that is a big hearty radish. I didn't know this was here! Okay, so... Alright, it's a good thing I have all three of her volleys, Gale, because... That over there is where the next shrine quest is going to be. <laughs> Alright. Okay. Hup. And... Hup. Excellent. You know what? I haven't used this in a while. Why did I take the mighty thistle? And unequip that quickly. Okay, good. All right, cuz you do not want to wait. You don't want to get struck by lightning just yet. You want to wait for a little while before doing that. See that thing right there? You're going to want to get struck by lightning on top of that thing. But I'm not going to do that just yet. There's going to be a few treasure chests here and... Oh, there he is. There's Cass. Wow, sang a little off-key there. You can make it up here in such rain. I had Ravali's Gale. I expect no less from a well-worn traveler like yourself. I stay nice and dry. My feathers repel the rain and rather well. This room was designed to withstand extreme moisture. <laughs> Sorry about the random cut, I was just taking a crap that I couldn't hold in. Of course, I know a song about this place. Would you like to hear the ancient verse? Yes. Oh. When a lost hero calls down lightning from the sky, from the sky, the monk responds from a giant mound on high. Lightning from the sky. So basically what he's telling you is that he wants you to get a song of storms. I couldn't resist. Actually, that's probably my favorite song in Ocarina of Time. Well, that and the Serenade of Water, which, as you probably already saw, my, blind, my second blind Let's Play was in Twilight Princess. I think, I'm actually thinking about making a remix of the Serenade of Water. 
Well, one with like all synthesizers, of course. And oh, it's the block. Okay, I thought that was a treasure chest at first. Whoa! Okay. <laughs> lightning, having lightning strike that close to me just reminds me of like this one day near, of this one day a couple years ago when there was a thunderstorm going on in my town and a thunderbolt struck one of my one of my friends house well struck the house of one of the assistant scoutmasters of my boy scout troop and even though I've been an eagle scout for three years at the time that crap why didn't I jump okay yeah, it struck so close to his house that he freaked out, and I th All oh, right. Uh, he freaked out, and I think temporarily blinded himself. Yeah, it was- that thunderbolt was so loud at that point, and... Okay, fine. I'll kill you guys with this. It- Excuse me. Thank you! How many- how much chew jelly do I have? 65! Okay, that's good. Uh, I can always, like, turn them into ice when I need to, and- Oh! Right! <laughs> it looks like a penis! <laughs> uh, I just realized that. Yes, I did! Bye bye. Then again, it's probably just drunk Minecraft on the brain, right? Probably just have drunk Minecraft on the brain right now. <laughs> uh, it's literally the only reason why I got Minecraft to begin with is because of Markiplier's drunk Minecraft LP. <laughs> which sadly had to end at episode 69, which is kind of funny. <laughs> it ended on an innuendo beat. Why do I have 265 arrows? Okay, I'm running low on arrows. Well, then again, you're gonna run low on arrows, like, pretty much later in the game. Well, like, at this point of the game, you're gonna be running out of arrows, like, really quickly, so... It'd be best to get it over with quickly. Um, oh, right. Get rid of this. And, do I have any... Health extensions cooked up? Yes, I do! Good. Eating that up. Okay, good. I do have Mephis Grace anyway. And... I'm actually gonna use my last- the last of my Revali's Gale to get that. Yeah! Because I don't want to risk climbing this thing. Because it's already too wet to be able to climb anything. Oh, I actually made it. Alright, so... I'm going to equip- I'm actually going to equip some metal weapons on purpose. Uh... Yeah, I'll equip the halberd. This and this. And I also better equip the best clothes that I have. There we go. Cut ahead to when I get struck. There we go. The Kakanata Shrine. The Kukan Mata Shrine. And it's a blessing, and I get the feeling I know what this chest holds. I was right. Rubber tights! Okay, as you would expect, rubber tights can protect you from electricity, and now that we've gotten that out of the way, it's time to finally take care of these stamp. Well, take care of these seeds. And actually, wait. Oh, never mind. There's nothing over there right at the moment. Actually, if I'm not mistaken, never mind. If I'm not mistaken, I think Farosh comes around over here. Oh, another shrine nearby. Okay, I think I know which one this is. No. Oh. oh, I'm not going there just yet. I want to go up there first. Raining still? Really? Okay, I hope I can make... I'm going to... How long? Okay, three minutes. 
Alright, I'm gonna see if I can make a campfire here. If I can't, oh well. Okay, good, I can. Uh, morning, because I do not want it to rain. Finally. So it's not going to rain for some time. Whoo, okay, good. Uh, you idiots could just go fuck yourselves. I can't believe I just said that, jeez. <laughs> Ah, Game Grump Syndrome is rubbing off on me. Great. Ah, treasure chest. I wonder what this holds. And stall goblins, I don't need your crap right now. I just want to get all this stuff out of the way. Here we go. What does this have? Purple rupee, okay. And you know what? Because I feel like being a jerk right now. I'm just gonna blow that up with a bomb arrow. No, oh, I love bomb arrows. I love bomb arrows in this game. Oh, I love bomb arrows when they were first created. And I... Th what the heck? Okay... Wait. Why? Oh, okay, I see. I was about to say, why was that even here to begin with? I'll use the royal boat. Topaz, opal ember, ruby, and another ember. Alright. Yeah, I forgot there was an area that has ro rocks like this on the ceiling. Wait, what was that luminous light? It looked like a gigantic luminous stone outside, but... Oh, what the hell am I even doing? What the hell am I even talking about right now? There we go. Uh, you can't get these with remote bonds. You need to use the bomb arrow for this. Okay, so... Oh, another flint. I have 116... I only got like I didn't even get sixty flints when I first did this game. Ah, uh, I'm amazed of how much I've improved since my first playthrough. To be fair, this game is like incredibly hard if you've never played this before. Because I have, this has became a lot easier. Ooh, acorns. Sixty acorns. Oh, that's a hardy lizard. Crud. Oh well. Uh, oh, tree branch. And that's there. Thank God I don't have to rain like I did last time. There we go. Hello. Bye bye. All right, so that's done. There is a shrine nearby here, so... Oh, I think I know where that shrine is. Um... Excuse me, dive mechanic! I wish you would die! Uh, I can't believe I just said that. Normally I don't even say stuff like that, but I hate this diving mechanic so much. Almost as much as I hate the toilet in my bathroom upstairs in my house. My toilet just makes so many sounds that shouldn't that shouldn't be made, and oh, I'm getting sick of that toilet. I really want to get a new one, but my dad was like, "It's only ten years old. You don't need to get a new toilet." Fuck off. Of course I do. I need a new damn toilet. Hold that. Okay, use it right there. Uh, let me get your horn. Oh, right. Wrong bow. Yes! Okay, so. Please don't electrocute me! 
Ow. Okay, thank God it didn't electrocute me completely. Uh. Ow, 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 no, 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 don't go down the waterfall. Okay, good. Uh, if I went down the waterfall, I would have pissed. Okay, so... I might actually do something different in the next episode. Like, once I get all the Koroxies I can find around here, I'm probably just going to go to it. Do something different in the next episode. Shard of Ferocious Horn. Okay. Okay, so I already have one of those. Wait, what? When did I get one of those? And Revali Scale's finally ready, but oh well. I'm not. Well, I don't remember there being three treasure chests at once over... Ah, this is a lake of treasure! I think most of this is gonna be rupees. Oh, it's gonna be mostly rupees and arrows. So, I'm gonna cut ahead to see what I get from those. Purple rupee. Ten arrows. Phrenic bow, I'm not using that. Opal. Shock arrows. Uh, I think this one is the Phrenic Bow. I'm not gonna take the chance, and yes, it is the Phrenic Bow. Hey, get on to the... Are you serious? I can't get up here. Okay. Down. Thank you. And now to get this. And put it in here. There we go. Thank you. Hello. Bye bye. I don't know why I'm talking in such a low pitch voice. Well, then again, I just woke up like a couple hours ago, so. Hey! And there should be a metal boulder over here. Why did I take the high roll back? Okay, 18. I don't really need that many high roll, much high roll bass anymore. Anyways, these chests that are over here, I'm actually gonna put this rock on land instead of back underwater because I get the feeling I'm gonna need this later. And these two chests contain. Get open the damn chest. Sapphire. Oh, Night Albert with durability up. Okay. Uh, what weapon? What weapon should I get rid of? I'll get rid of this one. I can always get another one of those, like, anytime I want, and I already know where to get one, so. I don't really need a Savage Lionel Sword. At least not yet. No. Now, Nice Halberd with extra durability up is a godsend for me. Now, I just need to... Find a way to get this thing out of here. I, I might have already figured that out, but... Oh well. Um <gasps> Are you kidding me? Come on. Okay. Okay, good. Uh, they've went to Floaty Town. Alright. Where's the other one? There's two of them. What happened to the other one? Oh, there it is. Okay. <laughs> In a blind spot. Alright. That's ca that's actually fair. Uh, and... Excuse me. Open this up. Thank you. Ice arrows. Okay. Get rid of this. Delete the stamp. 
Now I can try to climb that mountain. And... I really should have upgraded this before I went over there. I'm not gonna try it out this time. Nah. You know, I'm gonna use a Revali scale. I kinda don't wanna waste one here, but doesn't look like I have a choice. If thing is if this thing is higher than you can fly, then it's higher than you can climb with climb with a fully upgraded stamina wheel, if I'm not mistaken. I was right. Good thing I used it. Mount Flora. <laughs> Okay, now to get those three Korok seeds that are out of the way. Get out of the way, goat. I don't need you right now. Uh, I st why do I still have the ancient bow equipped? There we go. Alright, keep going. Up, up and away. Alright, uh, crap this. Thank you. Hello. Bye bye. Sorry if there's like not much entertaining stuff to talk about. Like, uh, well, the to leave the stamp. I really can't think of anything else to talk about right at the moment. Well, actually, yeah, I had an old. This is actually being recorded the day after the last episode was being recorded. So, yeah, I really wanted to record more of this game because I miss this game so much. Either way. Oh. Screw you! I told you to die earlier, come on. Oh, uh, what? Oh, I know what this is. Oh, right. Why do I. Oh, right. I need the mask on. Thank you. And how far up do I need to go again for this? Oh, I think that's it right there. Or maybe not. Maybe I put it in the wrong mountain? I'm not sure. Oh, okay. I think I might have. Oh, yeah. I've already gotten this one before. Oh, wait. There's two of them over there, if I'm not mistaken. Never mind. There isn't. Okay. I think I know this one. And... It, oh, yep. I know this one. Drop... That's this and that. Unfortunately, you can only have three of these up at once. So, come on. What did it? Oh, right. Throw with R. But what? Oh, wrong angle. Okay. Come on. There we go. <laughs> Give me a break. Cut ahead to when I finally get it done. There we go. Okay. Good. Hello. Bye bye. 69. Hooray. Oh, great. Electro keys. This isn't good. Can't. Ow. Die. Thank you. Alright. Ten. I think I need five more electro key swings to be able to... For... To need use for upgrades. Uh... Oh. There's the Rook's Boulder Breaker, okay. Oh, 
Oh, broken. Broken. Okay, no. Uh, what? Oh yeah, drill shaft. Break. Okay, thank you. Uh, equip this. You can always get the bully breaker back whenever. Yeah, there's nothing over there. Okay. Remove this. And now to get back over here. Alright. I'll be back on the top of Mount... I'll meet you guys back at the top of Mount Floria. Alright, now that I'm back at the top of Mount Floria, where you're gonna wanna go is like, right around there. Like... Go right back to where you got the Korok of Riola Spring, because there's a Korok Seed right down the waterfall there. And I think I know what that one is. Yes, I know, I know. And if that's the case, you're going to want to equip your Zora. Wait, didn't I... Didn't I make this... Didn't I tell you this green already? Uh, if I didn't, I'll show it again. Oh, well. Uh... Oh, no, I didn't. I have, like, over 40 highly... High rule herbs. Okay... Ah! No, I didn't. Okay. Oh, wait! Uh, but that, 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 get up! I do not want to get that yet. I want to get this first. Because money is more important than Korok seeds. Okay, no. Life is more important than money, and a lot of businessmen do not know that. Oh, whatever. Yep. Uh, come on! Oh, there it is. Alright. Open that up. Come on, open this up. Oh, there's another treasure chest over there. Ember. And I think this one also holds an ember. Either that or another opal. Oh, come on! I hate it when that... I hate it when your head is under the thing it breaks. Oh, I know this... I know where this next shrine is! Come on! Oh my god, this is a freaking gong show here. Ice arrows. Okay. Hurry up. Swim upward. There we go. Weeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeee
not mistaken, this flower will just go to specific rocks. Oh, treasure chest. And... Another rock right over there. Yeah, I'm not going to take the Zora armor off because I'm going to need to go back to that other area to, to the shrine. Where? Oh, there it is. Because I'm going to get that treasure. I don't think I've ever gotten that treasure chest before because I don't remember seeing that there. Hello. Bye bye. All right. So. I could have sworn there was another Korok seed up there, but oh well. Like, I'm probably looking at the map wrong or something. Royal Broads... Oh, okay. I'll gladly take that. You can go screw yourself in it. Ditch! Thank you for dying. I don't know if I picked up an arrow or not. Uh, yeah, I don't think I've ever... Oh, there's the arrow. I didn't pick it up. Okay. Yeah, I didn't get this right. I clearly didn't meet the, read the map right because I was just, like, trying to read it as quickly as possible. And... I think I'll be able to jump that? I'm, I don't know for sure. Oh, I can. Okay, how about that? Oh, I'm back with the whiz robe is great. Oh no, he spotted me! Oh, you ass. Freaking ass. You know what? Screw you. I ain't not even gonna fight you. I have a shrine to catch. There we go. And here we are. The so Shodasa Shrine. Impeccable timing. Oh! Yeah, this one is kind of tricky if you don't know what you're doing. So, put this down on here and then... Good. Um... Does that one give? I think that one gives the small key. I'm not entirely sure. If I remember correctly, that gives the small key. Oh no, it gives me ice arrows. Okay, the other one gives you the small key. All right. Oh yeah, I know this one all too well. Down. Ah, oh, come on. Actually, what I really like to do is just use Cryonis and get it over there the old-fashioned way. And... There we go. Yes! Done. Okay, I wasn't able to do this the proper way. I was actually able to cheat. Well, then again, I've been able to cheat at this shrine multiple times, so... Yay, I got the small key, and... <sighs> Surprised I didn't use any of the other three here, so... That should be... Back of time. Yeah, that's all the treasure chests. What's behind that door is the monk, so... I'll meet you guys back outside, now that I've gotten the next spear door from this area. Alright, back at the Farron Tower, I... Okay, screw these idiots. I'm going to kill them. Shoot them in the head. Bam! There we go. Alright. Ooh, multiple durians. I think you need these durians for something, actually. Yeah, I need these. You need these durians for the. You need a durian for this Korok seed right here. This one I remember being, like, very simple. Um. 
137 talents. Usually I have like 200 something right now. Uh Oh, there. Hold. There we go. I'm surprised that worked. Hello. Bye bye. All right. Now, if I'm not mistaken. Come on. What? Come on. You know what? No. Instead of wasting durability on the weapons, I'm just going to use some octo balloons. Get off! Oh. It's a big hearty rash. That wasn't worth it at all. Okay. My thistle, mighty thistle. Oh, it's PM. I thought it was AM. Okay. There we go. Why do the keys even exist in this game? Like, why do they appear randomly in other places? Seriously. Uh, mighty thistle. Okay, five. Uh, the next one is gonna be over here that we can. Next thing that we can get is gonna be right over there. All right, so I'm gonna revolve gale my way up here so that we can get. I can get the seed that I need to get. <laughs> I just barely had... Oh, I think this is the place where you get to fight a Lionel. Alright, so this is where you need to fight a Lionel, if I'm not mistaken. Oh no, this is where the Hinox was, okay. So... Uh, go down there. Another, oh, ah, another electric wizard. Oh, wow. Ooh, two hardy bass. Okay. Um, flipping. Where is the, oh, there it is. Uh, come on! C c why did I jump? Get up so I can use Cryonis here. Get up and open it up. Opal. Open that up. And what's in this one? Wizro, please do not spot me. Okay, so. Oh, it's down here. Okay. Oh, it's a. Oh, I think I know what this one is. I think for this, uh, but no. Why can't I zoom out? Oh, I know what this one is. Okay, good. Um. All right. So what you need, what I need to do is. There we go. Excellent. Hello. Bye bye. I think I have enough Korok seeds to upgrade a fully max out my bow slots now. Die. You don't deserve to exist. Oh, I think that's a metal ball? Yes, it is. What's under here? You know what? 
You guys can go screw yourselves. Okay, fine. You idiot. I don't even care about you idiots right now. And... There. No time. Get up, buddy. Thank you. Opal and purple rupee. Okay. Um, delete that. Okay, I'm gonna meet you guys over by the Kuta Kuka Nata Shrine to get the next Korok seed. Okay, now that I'm by this shrine, I've police the pit. Okay, that area over there. I believe that's this next stable that we need to go to. You're gonna want to have an empty slot when you go over to that stable. I'm not gonna spoil why, just know that you want an empty slot there. And I think I know what this one is. You can just screw yourself. Thank you. You too. Another key. Fuck off! Thank you. I swear, I swear, keys are so useless. I don't even know why Miyamoto bothers to put them in the game. Oh, Luminous Stone. Okay. I think I remember getting this one. Okay, I'm gonna save just to be safe. Oh, okay, good. I was right. Hello. Bye-bye. I don't remember getting a lot of these Korok seeds. There was only like 300 that I can remember off the top of my head, but... Otherwise, not that much. Not so much. Alright, so... We're gonna go down over there. Actually, we're gonna take this bridge and... Go to another place. Uh, yeah, we're gonna take this bridge. Oh, I think I know about- I think I know where this next Korok seed is. Yeah, I know- I like how the bull is actually taking the bridge on his own. Oh, hello, Farosh. Uh, let me see if I can get another horn from you. There we go. Alright, so looks like I'm not gonna get the Korok seed as soon as I thought I wanted to, so... Oh! Yeah, it's over there. Oh, it's a fan! Alright, I'll meet you guys over there. Or not, because I just found some treasure chests. And... Please go over there. Okay, two shards of Ferocious Horn. Uh, wait, first... Oh, there is a treasure chest, alright. Good thing I checked. Open up. Fire arrows, okay. We could have... 69 fire arrows. I don't know why I still laugh at that, because it's really immature, but oh well. Oh, five treasure chests, alright. Oh, six. Giant boomerang, I don't need you. Uh, better use this. What's this. Bop. Okay, give me that. Topaz, okay. Right. Oh, that was the moon. I thought that, I thought that was a freaking Korok. Oh. Alright. What's in this one? Fire arrows, okay. Get in. Bam. And... I don't think I've ever gotten all these treasures before. 
I like to see if someone is able to find every single treasure chest in the entire game. I... I'm not gonna try that out because I don't like this game as much as Okami, but still. I do like... This is actually one of my top five favorites game. Oh! Great petty bow! And it has extra durability. Good. I could use that. So... Purple rupee, and... What's in this last one? Okay. Um, Opal. Good. Revali's gale my way up. Let's hope I can make it on there. I highly doubt it. Okay, good. I actually did make it. I used Revali's gale wisely for once. Another treasure just down there. I'm not going to get that. All right. Oh, okay. So I'm going to need the ancient arrow for this. Ancient bow for this one. Boom. Bang. Firepower. <laughs> I don't know why I said that, but oh well. Uh, I'm having a good time. Yoop. All right, there should be a shrine right around there somewhere. Wow, I picked voice card. Wait, what? How did this not go away? I'm going to turn that into a Sam. Then I'm going to go over there. I'm going to go over there and I'll meet you guys back up at Farron Tower. Okay, I'm over here right now. Very close to the next Korok seed, which is actually a fan again and I think this one's gonna be more balloons yes it is oh oh that's not it okay oh okay There's more of them more balloons I don't remember this one too. Well, actually, I do remember this one, but I don't remember this one being a pain in the ass. So where's, where's the last balloon? Cut ahead to when I find it. Why can't I find it? Oh, I found it. There it is. It's too low for me to see. Ah, uh, that was a good one. Okay, now we're gonna go find that cave. Okay, so we should be we should actually be close by. Ah, there we go. Yeah, there's next table that Oh. I thought those were a bunch of rocks lined up, but it's not. It's I think it's a dragon head? Yeah it is. Anyways, here is the Farron Stable, I believe it's called. No, it's the Lakeside Stable, okay. Oh. Okay. What? Um, I don't remember this one. Where is this one? Oh, I know this one. Okay, I see. It's literally under the horse head, and I need to use a fire arrow for that. Bam. Hello. Bye-bye. All right, now, this next part, you're going to have to have at least one empty inventory slot. So I'm going to drop what I'm gonna drop the Royal Halberd for now. And talk to this guy. I'm straight to the top of that waterfall though. And even though it's shrunken over time you still see a faint glow. Mm. Wait, what? Is that the wrong person? Alright, I'm gonna see what I can get from Beetle. Well go It's rare, but almost be you almost never see. Please give it to me. I'll give you this fairy tonic. Sorry, but no. Really, I 
I just don't understand your thought process here. Maybe I'll sneak into his inventory and replace it with a common beetle. Okay, yeah. You're still here. Alright, what do you got? Okay, that's the only time he ever says that. Bye and take them all. Yeah. Alright. Uh, no. Not this time. Okay. Oh, right. Delete the stamp. And there should be a woman over there. Okay, see that axe over there? You're gonna want to remember that that's there. Oh, yeah, you have to sleep. I'm gonna sleep until noon. Oh, wait, actually, no. What is this book here? It's Rumor Mill Volume 6. Glowing Blue Bunny, it's talking about bloopies. We already know all about this stuff. Okay, that's good. Oh! I think that's the girl that we need to talk to. Lightning strikes the stable so often. I get nervous whenever it rains even a little. I just understand why it strikes often. It's a long short. If you have some time, could you find out why? Leave it to me. Normally, she's over near the horses. Thunder Magnet. You're going to want to climb to the top of this or Revali's Gale your way up, whichever you prefer. I prefer Revali's Gale, but because I'm out of it, I have no choice but to climb up to the top of this thing. Okay, so this thing. Woodcutter's Axe. Uh, I think you have to collect it. I'm not entirely sure. Uh, talk to her again. Oh, you do have to pick it up. Okay. Drop this for now. I mean, I'm, I am going to be coming back for it. Luckily, it doesn't respawn after... Well, it doesn't despawn after a given time. At least I hope it doesn't, because I really don't want to lose that good, really good petty weapon like that. Uh, go up. Keep... What? Why does it waste stamina on parts that we don't move over? Okay. Ow. Oh, and now that we have the thunder... Now that we have the woodcutter's axe... Doctor, you found what was drawing lightning? It was a metal axe. It's as good as a lightning rod, isn't it? Wonder if someone put it there. And she gives us a rubber helmet for our troubles. Yeah. A really good item from a really odd odd side quest. Now we just need the Thunder Tunic. And then we'll have to complete Thunder Set. I'm going to drop this woodcutter... Excuse me. Drop the woodcutter's axe and replace it with the Knight's Hobbard. Alright, now... Probably wondering how to get to this shrine. Well, this was actually one of the tougher shrines that I found here. What you have to do is look for a bombable wall right there. Now nah, I'm going to blow it up with remote bombs. I don't want to use any more bomb arrows. And now that you've got that, this is one of the tougher shrines that I found. The Shai Utash Uto Shrine. Halt the tilts. All right. Now uh, this one revolves all around stasis. And... Why did I not stop? <laughs> Cut ahead till when the time when stasis refills itself. All right, you wanna refill. You wanna stop the stasis once you reach the top of this area over here. I believe this one is a broadsword. I'm not mistaken. Yes, it is one with critical hit. I already have one with critical hit that I didn't get. They didn't use, so I'm probably gonna come back. Uh, what? Did not mean to use stasis, meant to use magnesis. Ah, uh, it doesn't stay there, okay. Frick. Oh well. Stasis on this thing. Stasis out. 
And I'm gonna need to go around the other side, because I know you need that chest to get the other chest that's up there. Like, up there. Trust me, you do need that chest. Oh, you do need this chest to get that chest. Uh, if I remember correctly, what's up in that chest is actually really valuable, so... Uh, ow! I'm going to... Drop this up there. Yes! Okay, normally it doesn't take me one try to get this, but... Ancient core. It's actually a good thing I went up there. Okay. Okay, normally it doesn't take me one try to get up there. So I'm actually glad it did. Uh, I think you need this to stay right there. And you need to put this on a stasis, because... There we go. And with that, we're going to end this video off here. So next time on The Legend of Zelda Breath of the Wild, we're going to be getting the last of these Korok Seeds down here, as well as get some stuff around this area over here. See you guys then.